Hello and welcome to our channel Marinos Point. I am Aman Kumar from marinospoint4.com. So today in this video we are going to discuss about the rotation of images part 2. In the previous video we have discussed the rotation of images part 1 where we have discussed 3D rotation of images. And now continuing to that part we are going to continue with the rotation of images based on cubes and patterns. So if you are a marine engineer or a belonging to a marine field you can check out our, our website minuspointpro.com where we have put various articles ranging from synergy exam to uh, to the various topics which you found on SIP like uh, the IC engine other topics of marine engineering and, and the auxiliary engineering you can find various quizzes also so if you are preparing for synergy exam you can visit our website where we have put various mechanical aptitude logical verbal everything so you can check it out now coming to our post videos so this is the continuation of the series where we are going to discuss the rotation of cubes with the patterns so let's start with the questions now in this case we will discuss this question number 16 in the last and we will start with question number 17 so here in these kind of questions what we need to do is we need to understand just the pattern like uh, if you see there is a figure these three patterns are there and we need to analyze this pattern and make our answer accordingly so for in the main figure what we see there is a cross like structure and in the middle of that cross uh, th there is a funnel like structure and this the line of funnel is uh, coming in the middle of this cross so we'll just have to figure it out because no matter how we rotate if we rotate it clockwise anti-clockwise upside down so this this uh, this straight line will always be in the middle of this shaded region right so we need to figure it out which will be the case in this kind of figure so in the figure a we see this is in the wrong side this line is on the wrong side so this is eliminated here we don't see any figures like that so this can be our answer here you see this is completely on different side so this is also wrong because this line is not coming perpend perpendicular to this so this is also wrong now here also this line is not coming perpendicular to the shaded region so this is also wrong now we left with answer b so this b will be our answer Moving on to the next question, here what we see is that in the on the top figure we are having zebra cro zebra crossing like a structure, black and white, and here we are having a triangle. So what we see is that the base of the triangle is coinciding with the black portion of zebra crossing, right? So this this these two figures coincide, and these black and black coincide. So we need to figure it out which kind of figure is having the same kind of thing. So if we see in this figure, so these are perpendicular to each, this triangle is perpendicular to zebra crossing. So this is eliminated. Here we don't see that zebra crossing, so we can keep it. Now here coming to this, this zebra crossing, this pointed figure is coming to the zebra crossing. So this is also eliminated. Now coming to this, this zebra crossing is touching the triangle base. So this can be our answer. So now we are confused between B and D. So now we will further eliminate the answer between B and D. So we will see here this is Z like structure and this is Z like structure here. So now when we this Z like structure will come in the front. Like right? so for that we will rotate this dice like this right. So when this Z like structure will come in front. So this triangle like structure will get vanished and this will come to this triangle like structure will come to this side this hidden side right but in here what we see is this when this z is coming in front so this triangle is coming in the upward side which cannot be possible because this triangle should be in the hidden side this side so this is also wrong so our answer will be d moving on to the next question here what we see is that there is a uh, tick mark and this tick mark is the long side of the tick mark is coinciding with the this diagonal line right so we'll need to figure it out which kind of figure is fulfilling the same criteria 
so here this diagonal is coming in contact with the small small side of the tick so this is wrong so here we don't see such criteria so this can be our answer here what we see this this is not touching at all this is not touching the tick at all so this is wrong and here also this tick mark is there but this is not this line is not touching this tick mark at all so this is also eliminated so answer will be b moving on to the next question so here what we see is this lightning structure like right? this is a symbol of lightning so we'll try to figure it out we based on this lightning structure so these lightning structure is found in a and b rest in the c or d we don't find that structure so we'll compare first a and b so let's start with a so here what we see is this lightning structure is in the way like this and this right this is the structure but here what we are seeing is this this which means this image is this image is the mirror image of this one so since it is mirror image so this cannot be our answer this is eliminated now coming to this lightning structure so what we can assume here is that if you see that uh, this lightning structure is having uh, this lightning structure is not symmetrical because here this uh, structure is having a broad figure broad line and here it is converging to some point like right? so the gap between these two boundaries is less and here it is more which means this figure is not at all symmetric so this when this figure is like is in this figure b it is as it is the question in the main figure it is like this and in the option also this is like this only which means that we can see the same structure of this lightning structure only when this box is not rotated at all because if we rotate like for example if we rotate like this to 90 degree so this lightning structure would have turned like this right and when we rotate uh, in anti-clockwise direction so this will be like this even if we rotate it 180 degree so this small uh, gap portion will come upside down and this large gap will come this small gap will move upward and this large gap will come downward but what here you see that the large gap is there and here also the large gap is there here the small gap is there here a small gap is there which means this figure is as it is the main figure so when the box is not rotated at all so which means that we should see the same figure at uh, on the other side as well like we so we should have seen z on the top and this jalebi like structure here also but this is not the case so this is also eliminated now coming to this c and d now we are left with c and d so if we uh, see in c so this z like structure if you see so this is mirror image of z if you can see this is like this so this is mirror not this only this so this is the mirror image of z this is not right z but on so this is also eliminated and here we see the correct representation of z is there so this will be your answer now coming to the question number 16 which is left so why i left here is because this is a bit debatable question or i'd say something is wrong in this question because if we see that uh, according to in the main question here if you see that this hexagonal so this hexagonal is coming across the diagonal of this cube right but if you see in the this hexagonal is coming in diagonal only in option d in rest of uh, all those figures a b and c this hexagon is coming in middle of this this box right so if we go with this answer but this is the mirror image because if we go with the moon so if we 
moon is like this which means the box has to be rotated like this so when moon will be upside down so this hexagon will come to left side if we turn this box to up uh, so that the moon will come on the top uh, so that the moon will become a reverse and like this so this box has to come in the left side of it but here the this hexagon is coming on the right side of it so this is with a mirror image hence this cannot be our answer and rest all are in the in rest of, of all the figure the hexagon is in the middle so none of these can be answered so that is why the question is wrong but if we make this hexagon like this if we make this hexagon like this so then uh, we can proceed with the question so the actual figure would be here this will be like this this is there and this is the moon now according to this we'll proceed if we proceed according to this figure then we can get one of our answer so for that what we see here is if in the first figure the moon is on the top so if we the moon is here so if we have to make moon on top we will have to turn it 90 degree from this line so if moon uh, if this figure will come on top so this hexagon will come down right on and on the left side so but here a hexagon is coming in the front side it should have been in the hidden face here so this will be eliminated coming to, to the next question next option so here what we see this moon is upside down in the right side only so to make this moon upside down we'll turn this cube like here upside down but one thing to be noticed here is like this pointed portion of the hexagon is coming in contact with this moon but here if you see this is not right at all this moon is like this if you try to visualize with this so this right portion this pointed portion this flat portion is coming in contact with this this is in line with the moon but here this pointed portion is coming in line with the moon so this cannot be our answer so this is eliminated coming to this so if to make this figure like this we just have to turn this leftward so if we make the moon come on the front so this will be rotated like that and here if we see this face this face of the moon this pointed portion of moon is coming in contact with this this base line so this can be our answer now coming to option d so if we see here this point so option d is already eliminated because this is coming diagonally right this is coming diagonally so this is already eliminated so option will be c so most of us will be reading through the pdf and where the answer is given c so this can be possible only when we when this figure is like this when this and when this hexagon is in the middle of this and in a straight way like this this so when this is like that only then we can assume this and this answer to be c otherwise this will be a wrong question so i hope you like this video and you got to know and learn, and learn something new so if you like this video please share with your other friends so that they can also get this concept and if you are preparing for synergy exam you can uh, get the material uh, in the link which is posted in the description below 
and in the upcoming video we will discuss about the the third part of our video will be on the rotation of images of the stated reason so till then bye and thank you